Good evening. Plastic shopping bags will soon be banned in Queensland, eliminating the disposal of up to one billion bags each year. Consumers will also be paid to recycle drinking containers after new laws were passed in Parliament. Lauren Day has the details. Queensland is bidding single-use plastic shopping bags for good. And ultimately, less plastic in the tummies of turtles and dugong and our other marine life in places like Morton Bay. From next July, consumers will have to bring their own bags to the big supermarkets. I welcome the decision of Coles and Woolworths to voluntarily phase out these bags nationwide. And while plastic is out, containers are in. <laughs> Container refund machines will offer 10 cents for drink bottles between 150 millilitres and 3 litres, an idea the LNP claims Labor is recycling. It was in fact our, our policy, we announced it, uh, we put pressure on the government to introduce the plastic bags ban. There is no way they can claim credit for this. But the latest news poll shows Labor would win a state election if it were held now, currently leading the LNP on a two-party preferred basis by 53 to 47%. I don't comment on the polls. I know that we are a united team. The poll also shows preferences from one nation would help Labor win. I have ruled out doing a deal with one nation. I have signed a statutory declaration. What Labor's doing, they're putting one nation last, so they are ostracising every one nation voter in Queensland. The Premier is currently in poll position for preferred leader and refused to rule out calling an election this year. And I haven't even thought about that. Lauren Day, 10 Eyewitness News.